Four years on the world stage, Sebastian Jambert looked good for his favorite tag throughout the season. With a 14-point lead and three race wins, he was hoping to secure his first title in the series. But his main rival this season has been no less hungry for success. At 31, Vincent Philippe has an impressive CV, which has seen him compete in the World Endurance Championship with considerable success. He too has been competing outside France for the past 10 years, but this year he's been racing for the double title winning LMS Junior Team. He has five victories to his name this year, but 14 points is a lot to make up heading into the final round. The protégé of Dominique Melion knows that he'll have to attack, but at the same time he'll need events on the track to go in his favour if he's to emerge victorious. Unfortunately for Philippe, the pressure seems to have got to him early on. A fall in warm-up session ahead of the race leaves him injured and hands the title to Gimbert on a platter. Well, he lost the back of the bike under braking, it slid out and he couldn't do anything. What caused it? Well, the tyres weren't up to temperature and the track is pretty cold in the morning. It's not exactly the best of recipes and the result is that he ended up falling. Vincent's got a broken wrist and they've taken him for a scan because he was pretty shaken up. He's regained consciousness though, but from the medical side of things, they don't want to take any risks, so it looks like he's going home, so it's pretty serious. I guess it's quite a shock for you. Well, it's a big shock and a big disappointment for Vincent, that's for sure. And for me and for all our sponsors, it was still up for grabs. Nothing was decided yet.